in this video we're heading to Bird's Famous Cookies, making tiny crispy cookies since 1924. I know they have these in different places in the U.S., but they don't have it here in the Great Smoky Mountains. The flavors that they have, it says they do have free samples as well. Let's give them a shot. Alright, here's... So they sell them, they're really tiny good cookies. Cupcake cookies, Georgia peach, key lime cooler, lemon cobbler, peanut butter chocolate chip, maple wafer, definitely want to try those. Scotch oatmeal, salted caramel, and they've got some gluten-free options here at the at the back side. They sell them in all kinds of different tins that you could take home. These are these are pretty nice. I might have to get one of these just because. Some Rice Krispie treats, and then they have different. They got jalapeno. I don't know that I would like that, even though I like jalapeno stuff. These are like kind of like snack cookies, I guess. Cheesy and salty goodness, it says. Alright. So we're going to get some of these and we're going to take them home. Get, we're going to get some of these and try them out. Alright, here we are back at... Uh, oh. The... <laughs> oh. I guess put them down. Alright. So here we are back at home with the cookies. And before we get started, I want to tell you a quick, funny, or interesting, I don't want to call it funny, it was just kind of caught me off guard. So I, I walked into the, to the store and there were two workers in there and neither one of them had masks on. And I just casually asked, uh, are we not wearing masks in here? Because everywhere I went, the workers mask, everywhere, mask, 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 mask were everywhere. So, um, and the lady said, no, it's just a cookie store and crappy cookies at that. So I she should have probably they called it cookies bag. Yes. <laughs> so I should have probably walked out then and said, you know, uh, I don't know about that. Not but a great I really wanted strategy, to bring huh? something home so we could review it together. And I know how much you guys love seeing these two. Right. Instead of just seeing this ugly mug all We the are time. pretty awesome. And they're right. gonna end up being bad. Now <laughs> One thing I want to show you real quick is this really cool cookie tin. I had to get this one. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put it yet, but I'm going to like that. It's a smoky melon. Yeah, it's really neat. The it's got some cookies variety. in it too. So what we, got, we got three flavors. We got two bags of chocolate chip cookies because um, it was a special. I got the fourth one free. So I went ahead and just got a second bag of chocolate chip. And I also got scotch oatmeal cookies and cupcake cookies. So I'm going to try a little bit of, of each. What one sounds the best to you? Chocolate. <laughs> cupcake. Scotch oatmeal. I don't like oatmeal. Woo! That was loud. This video is brought to you by the Yeah, that's what he said. Is this sponsored by the <laughs> no, and we're eating them. Apparently, not it's the complete opposite. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll see. We'll apparently, these cookies are terrible. <laughs> these are. This is located right in the downtown, so it's a nice place to grab a snack if they're good. There's those cookies. If you can see them, yeah. I already opened one in the back. Of chocolate chip. This one. We can move that one. All right. All right. Are we all trying something which one, different? Which one do you want? I'll try. You can try one of these. I, you won't want oatmeal. <laughs> right? I would try it. Do you like oatmeal? No. Cookies, oatmeal cookies. Mm, they're okay. Right. I like them when they come from our local oh, bakery. A double. Are you ready? Ready. All right. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna wish we had coffee or tea, aren't we? These, it's it's just a, mine's just an oatmeal cookie. Like, there's nothing special about it, and it's not iced or anything. Mine tastes a lot like a sugar cookie. Mine tastes a lot like 
Crunchy. Mm-hmm. A lot of crunchy. They're very dry. I'm going to try one of these. We're going to try one of these. Oh, Alex's are thinner than mine. So chips. mine were a little bit thicker. His are little thin wafers. It almost looks like, um, what is that cereal? Cookie. Oh, cook. Good crisp. Yeah. I don't love these birthday ones. I don't. They have a weird flavor to them. I'm trying to think. I really do think it's a lot like what I was kind of afraid it was going to be like. So when you get the containers of the shortbread cookies and the different kinds, that's exactly what it tastes like. So. I like, their, I like how they're called famous cookies. <laughs> I've so, never heard of them. If you like those kind of shortbread <laughs> cookies, if you like those um, those trays that you get at Christmas time with the little shortbread cookies, you would probably like these a lot. So, and they're great with coffee. I will say that. That's what I was going to say. If I was going to continue to eat them, I would want like my cup of tea. I don't drink coffee. Tea is good. Tea I, is good. I would like coffee too. <laughs> But they're good coffee cookies. You can't like them. <laughs> hard. Put them in their hole. But they're a perfect snack for, for sitting with a cup of coffee or, or hot tea. Mm-hmm. Um, eating by themselves, like, they're not good standalone. I think the oatmeal is actually my favorite of the three flavors we have because it goes, it, no, I take it back. It's got a funky aftertaste. Really? It was, I was good. The more you we, sat there, it just oh, it's just like we, yeah. We might suggest we might suggest buying this is cookies. Birds. Birds. <laughs> <laughs> um. So for I'm us, try another chocolate. I guess what we're trying to say is is that I really like the tin, and I'm glad I got it. You can use that for present. Um. They're all right. Yeah. If you had a regular chocolate chip cookie or these sitting there, Alex, which would you choose? Chocolate chip cookie, normal. The soft kind. So. Hold on. I need to drink also, water, guys. I don't know why she's that. Um, like the dip. There's this little like cookie dip that people make that has like a cream cheese and mm-hmm. and stuff mixed in. They would be really good with that as like a little. Cause you need something else with it. They aren't. They just are not great standalone cookies. So the bur- the cupcake cookies, the birthday ones, whatever you want to call them, cupcake cookies. Eh, uh, they had a strange taste to them. I like them. Well, like, I like kind them. Kind of a short bready taste. I like them better than the chocolate chip actually. And then they I don't almost eat taste soup. overcooked. And then the Scotch oatmeal cookies, good with coffee, but they they're almost not eatable by them edible no they're edible but they're not eatable <laughs> without a drink like they're almost too dry so yeah it, it's just our opinion it but if you do like shortbreads you'd probably like them that's for sure that is where i would leave it i feel like we've got yeah. too many cookies now so that was bird's cookies down in downtown gallenberg um i really wanted to love these i don't yeah it's i like them a normal meal like so the girl, though horribly inappropriate she was to, right. to say it. I wouldn't call them crappy was, cookies. Right. I would call them underwhelming. Would, underwhelming. But, I agree with that. But from a Gatlinburg A place right in downtown yeah, Gatlinburg. We want to be wowed. Let him sniff a cookie. Like cut this part out, but then like the part where he's sniffing a cookie. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> you, like some... <laughs> you like the cookie? <laughs> I don't know if they can see that or not. Well, not. This kitty is almost 20 years old and he has a sweet tooth. <laughs> <laughs> He's really. Alright, so if you have an animal, your animals will love these. Maybe these are perfect for dog treats. <laughs> He's like, yes, more. <laughs> He's trying to take full bites out of that thing. It's not the chocolate one. No, it is not. It's the cupcake. He likes it better than I do. Oh, yeah, He's like... on his death bed anyway, so. You go... <laughs> Wait, let him eat it. There you 
ain't nobody. He liked them. Maybe that's what he's our usual. Well, he, he didn't really want the cookies. I thought he just wanted up. <laughs> like a kitty biscuit. All right. That's Bird's famous cookies. Uh, downtown Gallenberg. All right. So if you've had these before, um, and whether you liked them or not, we'd love to hear down in the comments section. Let us know what you thought of Bird's cookies. And the person who likes these cookies the most is Cats. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not a person at all. <laughs> well, this has been another video from the Great Smoky Mountains. We hope you have a great day. God bless.